Hello YouTube, this is uh, your man again, Fred. I'm just uh, unboxing a tour bar hitch for the Honda CRV 2016 RM2 version. As you can see, this card doesn't come with the tour bar attached. So I went ahead and ordered a tow bar from my uh, supplier in the US and it's just arrived today. So I'm unpacking it at the moment, just making sure we've got all the parts, fixing bolts and see if there are any instructions attached. So I'm just going to pop this somewhere so that we can see what's going on. And I'll try and talk to you as I'm unboxing it. I don't have a phone stand, so it's pretty much going to be me talking out of the camera and just peeling away at some of this uh, clean film. The packaging itself isn't very good, uh, as you can see. It already come undone before it actually reached me. And I think they can do a little bit better in terms of packaging just because of the distance this thing has to travel just to get here. I'm not sure if you can see this, or if this is going to be clear on the camera. Let's just check that out. No, it's not going to be there. But if I zoom in on that, you can see already there are a couple of chips, um, paint that's been lost. And I'm not sure if this is how it's left the factory or has this happened in transit. But either way, I think they can do a little bit better with making sure that they put better packaging on the tow bar itself. I'll just show you a couple of details of what it is. Uh, see that come up, beauty. Not much information on it there, other than just uh, FedEx packaging. Okay, I'll set this down again and see if we can proceed with the unboxing. So this thing apparently comes already pre-drilled and there's no drilling required in terms of all the locator holes that have been marked and pre-drilled. What I find quite surprising about this whole thing is when you watch some of the videos on YouTube it comes out as if this is a you know piece of steel that you can kind of work with one person but just lifting it up I can tell you for sure this is no way going to be an easy task for one person okay I can see a packet with the bolts and fixators so I'm going to take that up and uh, take this off in a moment and for those of you that are watching this and wondering what is this guy doing uh, I'm not a technical person I don't work in a garage I don't do a lot of technical stuff. I do have a basic understanding. Uh, I don't possess any specialist tools. So if you see me using second rated materials, it's just what I have. And for most of the times, it works pretty well for me. Um, so I'll just show you what's come in the package. So I have something here. Uh, which I'm not quite sure what this is. 
Might be a pawn mod, might be some sort of a... Let's say it's a consumer. Uh, sorry for the video, the video is going to be quite choppy at the rate we're going. So what this is, is uh, consumer information. Consumer information, okay. Okay, so I think this is for after the tour bar has been featured, so that won't help me at all. There's a stage, and then there's another bit of information here which uh, kind of tells you what's what and where it's going to be located. Um, it's pretty basic drawing, so we'll have to go through that when we get to that stage. So, what are you bold? Couple of bolts, two nuts, couple of washers. Uh, some look like they might possibly be coated with something. Brass, uh, couple of spring washers, uh, galvanized washers there. Okay, so that's all that comes with this um, tour bar, and it's presumably a inch box so we'll go ahead take the rest of the stuff off and see what we can make of this and and I'll keep updating you so for now we'll pause and I'll catch you on the other side <laughs> 